Smallville star Alison Mack was arrested on Friday, April 20, over allegations of sex trafficking related to the reputed sex cult Sivem. Now, according to our legal expert, the 35-year-old thespian could face serious time behind bars for her role in this troubling enterprise. Alison Mack could be looking at up to life in prison, Julie Rendleman, NYC criminal defense attorney shares exclusively with HollywoodLife.com. It depends on a lot of factors including the age of the victims, the circumstances surrounding the sex trafficking charges and Ms. Mack's role in the crime. Rendleman added that it's the sheer severity of the allegations that Allison is facing that paint such a dire situation for the former TV star. She is the second in command in the cult, from the reports, and it seems like she was getting other girls to submit to sexual activity with some type of threat of violence. And then she gained monetarily from doing that. Like Allison, the cult's leader Keith Ranier was also arrested a month prior in Mexico, both are facing sex trafficking charges. However, if the victims are underage the already grim circumstances for Allison get even worse. It is too early to tell, but the maximum both Keith and Allison can get is life imprisonment, Rendleman said. If the victim is underage, that is more serious than when they are not underage. If the victim of sex trafficking is a victim of rape, then that is more serious than if it wasn't, so there are many factors. What Alison's role was in the case is going to play out, but you have to wonder if her defense will be that she was somehow threatened or manipulated into doing this and bringing other women in. If somehow the actress manages to bypass jail time, according to Rendleman, her troubles are just beginning. When you have a sexual crime like this, we are not just talking about time in jail, we are talking about the potential of serious financial fines, and more importantly, registering as a sex offender. While Allison may not get the most extensive jail time, registering as a sex offender is something she may carry for life if a prosecuted. As we've previously reported, former members of Zivem have come forward alleging Allison was Keith's right-hand man who found women to join the infamous organization. The female recruits were allegedly branded with Allison and Keith's initials. 